important are emotions when customer goes for shopping in a supermarket? Are they able to locate the required items? How much time do they spend in the supermarket? Have they got all the items listed on their list? The answer would probably be no. Thus, the question is how JASCO can assist the customer to overcome this issue. Innovative way to shop would be one of the best way to eliminate not all but most of the issues through the implementation of Smart Shopping Trolley. Hello, I am Sheetal Mukesh Kumar, the Information System Manager at JASCO. I was given the responsibility to work on this project on, of implementing a new Smart Shopping Trolley for JASCO. The main objective of this project is to improve the shopping experience of customers in supermarket and at the same time provide value added to JASCO as a whole. The topics that will be covered throughout this presentation are Introduction which is further divided into four parts What is Smart Shopping Trolley? How it is utilized? The associated risks and experience of other company Next will be the resources used in the implementation of Smart Shopping Trolley and the key area that JASCO management will be keen on at looking at the required changes on the organization's process and effect on the main four departments as well as the cost, benefit and sensitivity analysis. Lastly, this presentation will end with conclusions and recommendation. What is Smart Shopping Trolley? It is a serviceable mobile system that is used in supermarket for the ease of customer to shop. And to do so, customer no longer need to write out their shopping list on a piece of paper or memorizing it. Hence, with this new system, customers can prepare their shopping list from home on our website. Next is how customers can utilize the usage of Smart Shopping Trolley. Frankly speaking, we all know as customer we had once in our lifetime faced unpleasant situation in supermarket. For example, how hard to search for stuff to find out about the price of item. How difficult to find out about daily deals. Did we find them easily or did we need to search the whole store for them? With this new innovative idea, Smart Shopping Trolley will assist customers in organizing their trip through the alley with the help of navigation system that acts like a GPS. Moreover, as customers pass by the alley, they will be notified of any promotion, discounts and offer that are available at that point of time. Besides, with the Radio Frequency Identification in short, RFID Reader, it will also help customers to know more about the items, for example, its price, nutritional content, ingredients, expiration date, and product reviews. Furthermore, customers could buy exactly according to their budget, as all scan item prices will automatically be calculated. Lastly, at the checkout counter, the billing process is automated, hence no more waiting in long queue. How advanced a system can be, there will, there would still be some associated risk to it. Firstly, the anonymous damages which is difficult to detect who damaged the trolley. Next, the unexpected technology failure which will lead to customer dissatisfaction. Impulse purchases whereby customer would not over purchase since the total amount showed up front on the screen, which may impact on JASCO's total revenue. And finally, it may look complicated to some of the customers. However, this can be eliminated in short period of time. Moving on is on the experience media card encounter using Smart Shopping Trolley. The managing director, Brian Peterson, said that during the average 25 minute shop, Customers could expect about 8 minutes of ads, each one no more than 10 seconds long. He also said that in US trial, participating store sales hiked by 10%, while sales of featured product hiked by 30 to 40%. In order for a system to run, there are, there are four main components that needs to be considered, and those are application software, networking such as Wi-Fi, database where all the items and customers detail being stored and hardware which I would suggest on using RFID technology since there are few advantages associated to it such as it senses events and captures related data in a way 
that does not require line of slight visibility between the tag and the reader. It is more resistant to hostile environments and can survive the effects of excessive levels of dust and moisture. It can store more information and finally it provides anti-theft capabilities that can verify that trolley contents have been paid for on exit. From these slides onwards are the major area that the management will be interested to look at on how this new smart shopping trolley will impact on JASCO's performance as a whole. Firstly, the changes on the organization's business process comparing the manual shopping trolley with smart shopping trolley. With smart shopping trolley, billing processes are automated which will not only save time but processes are done more efficiently. Total amount calculated upfront and navigation, pro pro navigation provided to each customer's life in searching for a particular item and promotion showed at the point of purchase which will assist our team to deliver targeted communications. This process will streamline JASCO's operation. Secondly are the changes on the relationship between JASCO's, between JASCO and their customers and suppliers. Business to consumer electronic services which allow personalized and interactive services by having database where customers' behaviors is monitored or analyzed and JASCO can alert the customer when there is certain promotion on an item that is regularly been purchased. This will also enhance customer loyalty. Whereas the relationship with supplier, JASCO can log in into a contract with clear requirements since different suppliers have different subcategories. Hence, this needs to be standardized and adapt to any changes as of when required, for example, certain changes in technology. The other effects are on JASCO's four major departments which are as follow. For Human Resource Department, since the billing process is controlled automatically, checking out process at the checking out counter is reduced. Indirectly, it will also reduce human intervention and error when punching in an item. Besides that, training needs to be provided to the existing staff on how to operate smart shopping trolley. Sales and Marketing Department, where JASCO can cater targeted promotion either to individual Prior to customer shopping history, advertisers are able to channel valuable communications to individual customer and deliver a powerful visual message right at single interaction point. Or, in general, when customer login or passing by an alley, JASCO is able to tailor their message to customers based on their location in the store. All this information will help JASCO in improving operations and providing timely communications regarding items on special offers and indirectly increase in sales. Finance and Accounting Department, there will be initial investment required at the beginning of the implementation of this project, however, it will be offset in upcoming years. Besides that, maintenance charges will be ongoing to keep the system working adequately. Lastly, the effect on production and inventory, where a pattern of daily purchase can be estimated and inventory could be managed accordingly. And JASCO will not run out of stock since the process is automated. Besides that, JASCO's floor plan needs to be restructured in such a way that items that are provided more that items that are more profitable will be placed at the main entrance along with its complementary goods next to it. From the presentation, we can see that the main costs involved in this project are on the hardware, software, networking database, installation, maintenance services, and training costs. While for the benefits, JASCO will experience an increase in sales since promotions are provided at the point of purchase, Reduction in workforce as billing process been automated and JASCO will have a better understanding on customers' behavior without any capital outlay with the implementation of Smart Shopping Trolley. This slide discusses on the combination of cost and benefit analysis using RFID technology that is being proposed in this project and other three sensitivity analysis using different technology that is out in the market. 
kindly refer to the spreadsheet provided for further detailed breakdown on each component and note that the changes are only on the cost of the system whereas other total costs and benefit remain constant. Initial scenario is using RFID technology, scenario 1 uses barcode, scenario 2 wireless sensor networking and scenario 3 uses USB firmware. From the table, we can conclude that all four scenarios provide a positive net present value, internal rate of return is greater than discounted rate, and the profitability index is greater than 1. For the proposed technology, RFID, the payback period is 3.42 years, which can be considered as fast, fast recovery, although it is among the longest recovery period as compared to other three scenarios, since RFID is one of the costly technology. From the analysis, we can say that barcode technology looks more value added to JASCO since this technology is lowest in terms of initial investment, higher in net present value, less payback period, largest internal rate of return, and high profitability index. Thus, based on the overall analysis, although barcode technology provides better results, I would still suggest that we should consider RFID technology, although the initial cost of RFID technology is high, but in subsequent years, the technology will be beneficial as compared to barcode as well as other advantages, advantages that was discussed earlier. Although the technology is costly, however, this can be offset with the cost reduction in workforce wages. Thus, in the long run, the running cost of RF RFID is negligible. There will be increase in customer satisfaction as customer will not experience out of stock for item that is on their list and increase in time efficiency for all the parties involved. Hence, with this, I would recommend that we should proceed with this project since it is certainly a profitable project and the returns are greater than the risks and costs associated. Thank you for your time and should you have any questions, I'm happy to answer them.